welcome another edition of Tuesday Talk. We have the beautiful Lee Killer with us today, um, highlighting her very impressive skills as a musician, businesswoman, kind yes. of. Yeah, yeah, our time. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, of course, uh, you know, this month we're featuring Women in Business, and we wanted to talk to Lee about um, her passion for music, really, and I guess I'd like to know where that all started. I would say yeah, very young, because in our house we always had music playing. Whenever we cleaned, my mom would always have uh, music going, and then I would probably say grade seven or eight, my mom uh, started playing a little bit more around the house because she can sing she plays guitar. Really? Oh, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. So, shout out to Shasha, <laughs> Mama K over there. Yeah. Um, oh, Master Bill. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Mom. Um, so, she really taught me, and, you know, um, with, you know, started with The House of the Rising Sun was the first song I ever learned on oh, guitar wow. and learned how to sing. Um, Joni Mitchell, just a lot of the old folk classics. And then mm -hmm. from there, through high school, I did more of the sports thing, but then after I graduated, I really dove into music and started playing. You know, nice. slowly started playing out out in the out in public. Yeah. So. so, how do you find that balance between your careers? It you know it can be very difficult because with the music um, the music portion of things, which I you know it's a passion and it's driven by it's totally driven by my love for music. Uh, so I you know I have I work during the day. I'm a director of recruitment and partnerships for a not for profit organization. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then to find the time to do this because uh, you know a three hour gig just doesn't happen overnight. You got to go into the rehearsing. Mm, of course. You got to go into you know pick up a guitar anytime you have some time. Mm -hmm. and, you know play a couple songs or, or learn some new stuff. Um, writing music takes a lot of time as well. So finding the balance is difficult. But you I really just make sure to plan it. Um, it can I can wing it a lot. I do that often. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> um, but I do make sure, especially on the weekends, to plan some time for music, which it, which isn't difficult because no, I you enjoy I, it so much. I yeah. want to do yeah. it, and yeah. I feel fortunate to be able to do it. To be honestly, as a career, um, I feel very fortunate that I get to do that. So. Excellent. Yeah. Now, um, if you haven't been out to see Lee uh, sing and play, uh, we have you have a gig coming up. I do. Yes. This. Saturday. Yep. So I'll be playing from 7 to 8 at the Raven in Republic, and I'll be um, playing just before the Rodents. We're doing a tragically hip tribute. So oh, nice. I'll be staying there for the remainder of the evening. Yes, and uh, there'll the be a few people there. Yes. Yeah. The tragically yeah. hip. Excellent. It'll be great. No, Excellent. So, yeah. Excellent. Well, it's always nice, always great to see young women in business. Mm -hmm. Entrepreneurship for women is fantastic. It's huge in North Bay, which we're finding out every time we do this. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, it was really nice speaking yeah, to you. Thank you. Thank you. Everybody have a great week and get out. Yes. See Lee. Enjoy Tragically Hip Music on the weekend. Talk to you soon. Thank Bye. you. Bye.